सो विच लैपटॉप शुड यू बाय इन 150 टू 250 डॉलर बजट सो आई विल नेम आउट सम ऑफ माई फेवरेट्स इन दिस बजट देन शो यू थ्री ऑफ देम एंड पॉइंट आउट द थिंग दैट मेक दम वेरी गुड परचेज एंड वाई यू शुड एंड गो फॉर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ लैपटॉप आई मोस्टली डील इन टू ब्रांड डेल एंड डिलोवो स्लैश थिंक पैड सो आई विल नेम दीज सो टी फोर एटी टी फोर एटी एस टी फोर सेवेंटी पी टी फोर नाइन्टी टी फोर नाइन्टी एस एक्स टू एटी एक्स थ्री नाइन्टी आई हैव नॉट यूज दैट वन पर्सनली बट डेल डेल सेवन थ्री नाइन्टी डेल सेवन फोर नाइन्टी डेल सेवेंटी फोर हंड्रेड डेल लैटीट्यूड सेवेंटी थ्री हंड्रेड एंड देर इज ऑल्सो डेल फाइव फोर नाइन्टी एंड फिफ्टी फोर हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी थ्री हंड्रेड बट आई डोंट रियली यूज दैम पर्सनली वाई यूज दीज लैपटॉप्स एंड नॉट अदर लैपटॉप्स दीज आर यूज बिजनेस क्लास लैपटॉप दे हैव अ बिल्ड क्वालिटी दैट इज बेटर दैन अदर लैपटॉप इन द सेम बजट इन द अदर कैटेगरीज बट देर इज वन अबव कैटेगरी विच इज द एक्स वन कार्बन एंड द डेल एक्सपी एक्स सीरीज बट दे आर अ बिट मोर सेंसिटिव एंड स्टिल अ बिट एक्सपेंसिव टू बी रिकमेंडेड लाइक दीज सो वाई दीज लैपटॉप दीज कम विद इंटल एट जेन CPUs. These are quad-core CPUs, unlike their 7th gen and lower counterparts, and they provide the same performance as 11th gen and 10th gen CPUs. All right, so they will give you the same performance as 11th gen i5s and i7s in laptops, without spending a, hundred, a few hundred dollar more on them. And they are the first laptop to come with Intel TPM 2.0 that will allow Windows 11 support officially. And the main thing I will say with a before buying this laptop, always get one with a 1080p display. Anything lower is useless, and backlit keyboard is nice to have. And these also have Type C support that you can convert to DisplayPort HDMI or even charge these with Type C. However, the Dell ones come with both Type C and barrel jack, but uh, the Lenovo ones only use the Type C for charging. Now going through the ones I have, I have this. Personally, I use this T four eighty S, and these also provide a lot of Type C for charging, Type C, and this is the docking hub thing. RJ forty five full size USB HDMI full size SD card headphone jack full size USB and a lock connector. sim tray if you have the card installed the cellular modem installed on the laptop this is the other one i have the dell 7490 this has the barrel jack dell standard charging and type c so it takes type c but i have seen only it use 15 watts not the full 65 watts it does in the barrel but still it's a nice to have full size hdmi full size usb 2 smart card reader rj45 full size usb micro sd card headphone jack and sim tray if you have the modem installed now i will use this laptop and show you there features so this is the dell is running windows 11 it has backlit keyboard it has a joystick track point thing in the thing pad it also has that i5 8350u four core eight thread 16 gb of ddr4 disk is nvme 256 gb and wifi dual band wifi with the display you can see this is on full brightness so on lower brightness It's pretty decent actually, never disappointed me. But the speakers are not that good. But let's check.
they're still pretty decent now this is the other one this is the mac os pretty much the same thing is the i5 8250u and 16 gb of ram same gpu same ram configuration same nvme 256 gb storage and it's also able to handle most things now in this one the, the colors are not that saturated that, like that that one but still it's good enough it's 1080p ips not any lower quality like something else the speaker board speaker quality i will say on this one is pretty trash like don't buy this if you want good speakers the speakers are bottom bottom facing and these suck these are usable usable but still not that good so if we open these up you can see these are fairly repairable and upgradable so this is a t480s one nvme slot they you can add a second storage drive instead of the cellular modem if you want to but you need a specific size drive and specific key of the drive to do that wi-fi and we have a ram slot interesting thing about this laptop it has 8 gigabytes of storage solder on but rest you can add i have added another 8 gigs but if you can add 16 gig you will have total 24 gigs installed this is the cooler and the cpu battery is replaceable and this is the thing is the cooler is better on t480s than the t480 but the t480 standard version has a lot of benefits that has two dedicated ram slots and two dedicated batteries but i was looking for something portable so i bought this one this is a bit thinner and bit stronger build than the t480 standard version but there is also the t470p that is a 7th gen but it comes with the quad core and and tpm 2.0 as well so that is also a good option now coming to the dell ones 7490 now this has also has one nvme slot and also has a lte slot that you can try to mount storage i don't didn't did the research on this one wi-fi slot and it has two dedicated ram slots and battery cooler is a bit smaller than the lenovo though and yes i can say i have heard this fan be a lot noisier than that one i think is because this is one heat pipe version now this one is very similar to the other tools this is from dell same power power adapter type c that also takes in charges and displays out the display port hdmi full size single usb lock slot ethernet jack single usb full size micro sd card a sim tray and a headphone jack this one is the latest use 7390 it's also a generation and has all the advantages all the other laptops from this era have so it's working so i think i will finish this up and send it to my friend mr wick who ordered this laptop from me